Hey, Bella Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, you guys, build a bear. It seems to be like there are every time I turn around, somebody's selling a build a bear for big money. And I'm like, I've done some videos before, but I am really going to dig in and find the top 10 highest selling build a bear. So these are the ones that you want to look for if you want to make the big money. Unbelievable. Just unbelievable. Wait until you guys see these. And there might be a couple bonus. We might go over a little 10, but um, 10, we'll just say 10. All right. Um, my newest owl and zombie bargain hunter sent this to me as a gift. It is a big, huge squish mallow owl and I love it. Um, so shout out to zombie bargain hunter. You guys go and sub him up. He knows so much about plush. Um, he sells tons of it. So his what sold videos are jam packed with plush. So check it out. Um, all right, you guys ready to see these build a bear? Now there are tons and tons and tons of build a bear that are bread and butter. So these are the big money ones, you guys, the big money. And I'm not only going to show you, I am going to prove it. What do you mean? What do you mean, Courtney? How are you going to prove it? I'll show you. And this is just a good tool to learn anyway for when you're searching comps. So um, let's get started. All right. The first item. Okay. So this is the build a bear. And I'm not even sure how to pronounce this. A X O L O T L axolotl. Axolotl. I don't know, but it's this little pink guy. I don't know if it's a dragon or if it's like to some sort of movie. I don't, is it a Pokemon? I don't know. But this one uh, looks like a best offer was accepted. So I'm really not 100% sure on this one uh, and free shipping. But wait, there's more. Uh, right here. Thank you so much. We love her packaged carefully. So this was paid for. Um but I just don't know what the best offer was, but definitely a bolo. So let's move on and let's look at some of the other ones. So here are some of the other solds for this same Build-A-Bear. So you can see this one is not huge money, but definitely some nice, um, I mean, there's some hundreds. Definitely one to be on the lookout for. I sold a Build-A-Bear tonight for $53 and I was super excited about that. I just wanted to make sure I had my screen share up. So we're getting a little bit higher here in price. Mine was a La La Lopsy, I think is how you say it. And I picked it up at a garage sale and I sold it, I think for $53 tonight plus shipping. I think the buyer was all in for like $70 something. So you can see here we're up to like $160. For that background. So now we're up to 200. All right. So there it is. Um, the next one is the build a bear bison, the buffalo bison. It is retired. This guy's got on some clothes. It looks like it sold for 315, but they took a best offer. And again, it looks like it's had some love. All right, so I'm going to prove it. Looks like they paid. Wonderful. Quick shipper. Thank you so much. So you guys, there's a feedback uh, search bar. You can put in a keyword there, hit search. It's going to pull up everything with that keyword. So I put in bison and there it is. So we know it was a good sale. And then I'm also going to show you solds. So 165, 192, best offer, best offer, best offer, and best offer. But even here on these auctions, the lowest one went for 165. The next one is this Build a Bear Downtown Disney Dog. And you can see here it's got this written on the foot. And it's super, super cute. This is a harder to find one sold for $399. Looks like it's from 2012. And you can see 
Build a Bear Downtown Disney Dog, three hundred and ninety nine dollars. Amazing kind seller who really went the extra mile. Item came in amazing condition and will be loved for years to come. Wonderful, definitely, or would definitely purchase again. And there's not many of these, but the two solds, it looks like one went for $99 and then one went for $450 or best offer. So I'm not sure what the condition was like on this one. Maybe it wasn't as, it looks, well, that one has yellow. I don't see yellow on this one. So maybe that was a different one. The next one is this Build-A-Bear Stingray. And this is a harder to find one. This is new with tags. And that one is new with tags. I believe they were the same seller. Yes. Sold for $175. And um, looks like the same buyer bought both of them. And here are some of the sold stingrays. So they kind of range 65, 107. So there are some different, it looks like blue and black um, are the, the colors those come in. But definitely, um, definitely in a bolo. Looks like gray too. The next one is this Build a Bear Boorific Ghost. Now, there are other ghosts, and some of them are bread and butter. This guy is the big money one. So he sold for $200. And you can see right here, item was paid for. Looks like they had another one that sold for $200. And I'm going to show you here. This is a set. So it's the ghost and the mini ghost that went for 280, 225, 200. These are different, but I wanted to go down here and show you. See, like this ghost is different. It went for $39.99. These are different. You see the difference? So these do not go for as much. So don't mix it up. Don't see a build a bear ghost and be like, ah because they're different. See the face? This is the one you want. The next item that sold is this Build-A-Bear Workshop Baby Panther Cheetah. And he's got some love. Sold for $202.50. And feedback right here, $202.50. Feedback left. And here are some of the other ones, $250, $202, and then this guy's, so these are the cheetah panthers right here. Nice little bolo. This guy, Build-A-Bear St. Louis and Dean Bear, uh, $281 this guy sold for. And... Here it is, shipping, or I'm sorry, feedback, 281. And here are the solds right here, 285 and 281. There's only two of them. So it definitely, it looks like it's in a rare exclusive um, bear. And it looks like somebody just used somebody else's title because I was like, oh, it's the same bear, but you can see the backgrounds are different. So it's a different listing. The next item is this Build-A-Bear Giggly Piggly Rainbow Pink Bear. Oh, they put a little arrow showing the little hole in the foot. That's interesting. Right there, see it? 305 this one sold for. And you can see that it was paid for. And... 305 and 270. This one is unstuffed. Okay. So they still sell even if they're unstuffed. The next item is this Build a Bear Jack o' Lantern Pumpkin Halloween Cat. Okay. So from what I understand, if I think this is the one, somebody did a TikTok or something, a video on this that went viral and then everybody wanted this cat, I guess. Not 100% sure. I think I heard that somewhere. I could be wrong. If anybody knows for sure, let me know in the comments. But this cat sold for $370 plus shipping. And you can see feedback was left $370. And here are some more that sold. So this one sold for $710. I did not confirm that. But um, it comes with a little pumpkin outfit. I mean, just unbelievable. 
So this cat is definitely a bolo. I don't know if it's just trending right now or if it's going to stay a bolo. Same with all of these. Um, I feel like this cat is a little bit maybe easier to find because you can see how many solds there are. But that TikTok video made everybody want it. So, I don't know. Look at this guy. He's not, that's not too bad. 90 bucks. But you can see there's a ton. Like the one I just did, there was only two. So the rare ones, I'm going to guess, are going to hold their value. This one, I don't know if it's going to be a bolo forever or not. It may just be trending right now. Here's another really good one. It's Build-A-Bear Werewolf Plush Moons Aglow. And you can see the feet. It has moons on it. This guy is a huge big money bolo. This one sold for $515 plus shipping. Proof of life, 924.21. Uh, I don't know what that means. Does anybody know what that means? Uh, 515 plus shipping. Maybe that it's actually their item. I, I don't know. Uh, but you can see here that it sold and feedback was left. And here are some more solds. 515, 375. There's also a gray version. This is the Howl, Howl. Oween Halloween Wolf. It's also a bolo. So I'm just going to scroll through these. Tiger Wolf? I don't know. So you're getting more than 10, especially when I scroll through here. This is like a rainbow colored wolf. So I guess if you see a wolf, look it up because there's multiple. Uh, but the moon's a glow is the big money one for sure. Pretty cool, right? Can you believe it? All right. The next one is I found this one by looking at the feedback on the other one. And I was like, oh, it went for $123.99. I'm going to show it also. So we are over 10. Um, but this one is coming unstitched. And it still went for $123.99. I don't know what's so special about that one, but this one went for $100. So there's two comps. And uh, so to me, that's good enough for me. I'll, I'll look for that one. And this Build-A-Bear Bossy Silver Ford Mustang 50th Anniversary Limited Edition. This one is super, super rare. Sold for $499.99. It's got the horse on the the Mustang on the paw there. It's got the little bandana. And you can see it was paid for right here. Bam! $499.99. And there's only one sold, you guys. So this one is a super hard to find. But just unbelievable to me that a stuffed animal can sell for $500. Just it's crazy. It's just crazy. Um, but there are people that collect things and that's why it's always good to look up comps. If you're unsure, check comps. If you don't see any others, start that item on auction and start it high. And worst case, it doesn't sell. And then you relist it as a buy it now or best offer. Like the person that had that Mustang horse, they could have seen no comps. And if they don't have worth point or, you know, another way to look it up, they could have listed that for $50 or best offer because they didn't know. Um, again, I highly recommend worth point. Um, I have a video over on my sourcing with Bolo Buddies YouTube channel where I show you how it has already paid off for me. I was like, for the longest time, I'm not getting worth point. It's too expensive. I won't use it enough. But really, now that I have branched out so much into vintage and hard goods, it is really worth every penny, you guys. Um, go check out that video on my Sourcing with Bolo Buddies YouTube channel. I'll show you how it's paid off for me. There is um, a link down in the description that'll take you over to Worth Point, And it is a referral link. So if you decide to sign up, I do get a little bit of a commission. Um so I'd appreciate it if you'd use my referral link. Unfortunately, there's no coupon or anything like that. Um, it would just be, you're helping me out. 
Um, it doesn't cost you anything to click on that link and I get a little kickback. But go check out the video first. Again, I was one of those people that was like, I'm not doing it. I don't need it. Um, and honestly, like I use it all the time and I love it. So um, I actually asked my husband, I'm like, hey, I've been thinking about getting worth point, but you know, it's kind of pricey, but you know, I can write it off because it's a business expense. Um, and he's like, well, I, I kind of am interested in it also. And I'm like, sweet. So it was kind of a no brainer once we were both on the same page that we wanted it. And I went ahead and ordered it. Um, I signed up for the whole year. Um, I like to, if I'm going to do a subscription and I know it's something I'm going to use, if it's a month by month, it's usually more expensive. So I just bought the year. That's how I do it. I'm not saying you should do that. Uh, maybe try it for a month or two and see if you use it. Um, but I am using it all the time and I love it. All right. If you made it this far, leave a, is there a dinosaur emoji? Put a dinosaur emoji if there is one. If not, just write dino. <laughs> All right, you guys. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And go find these Build-A-Bear. Yes. And let me know if you do. All right. Thanks for watching.